Next business hopeful to prove their market penetration capability is PictureChart, who aims to make data information on the web more engaging for its users. Armed with the aesthetic data design tool, PictureChart hopes to snag a partner to help them market to the masses. Really nervous uh, about going through the pitching because uh, this is my first time and I've been told about this last minute, but I have made preparations for the pitchings according to what I Ching and Andrea have uh, advised me about, so I do hope I do really well for the pitching later. Hi, my name is Leong Wayin. I'm a developer from PictoChart. And uh, let me begin with a video from my the co-founders, uh, I Ching. Hi everyone, I am I Ching from PictoChart again. And this time we are recording and shooting from all the way from Silicon Valley. So when we were given the task, we thought that we could spend it all on um, marketing, which is also what we call customer acquisition. So in all our marketing efforts, um, PictoChart measures what we do with the money in terms of ROI. So how many new users do we get and how much of revenue can we make? So we estimated that we have about 4,000 clicks using Google AdWords and we estimated we get 40 paid users and about 10,800 ringgit in revenue. Uh, the, UR, the ROI that we were expecting was two times. So for 5,000 ringgit, we were expecting to get 10,000 ringgit. But instead, we actually uh, experimented a little bit and we used some more targeted banner advertisement and we got 6,000 clicks, 60 paid users and about 16,000 ringgit in revenue. So that gives us an ROI of about three times more compared to what was given to us in the short 5,000 ringgit. Hi, a very good afternoon to the honourable judges. My name is Leong Wayin. I'm the developer of PictoChart and uh, we are here to make your information beautiful. I'm here on behalf of the co-founders Ai Ching and Andrea today because they are currently in Silicon Valley. In the beginning of mid-March, when we first launched our pro version, we had a total of 10,000 users with about 100 of them being paying users and we began with uh, 3,000 ringgit worth of revenue. And later on, three months later, around the beginning of July, we have about um, 30,000 users and about 1,200 of them being paying users. And then, uh, in total cumulated revenue, we have about 100,000 ringgit. Where so do your customers come from? Uh, most of them are from the Europe and US. So immediately you have uh, West, more of the Western Hemisphere customers, yeah? Yes, that's right. H how do you currently charge for your products? Uh, our current model is a subscri subscription base where the monthly uh, is $14.99. Uh, no, sorry. $14.99, if I'm not mistaken, because we did change the pricing once in a while uh, to adjust to the amount of uh, demand and feedback from the users. And for yearly, it's 129 USD per, uh, per year, yes. How long did it take for you to actually finalize and then uh, finish this app uh, to show to us today? Um, when we first launched the pro version, that was considered as finalized. But of course, we, from then, we received real feedback from paying users about how our app is not fulfilling their needs. And so from then, we kept upgrading and adding more features to suit whatever they requested. So oh, I so would say that the app would have been stable, uh, as in fulfilled most of our customers' uh, satisfaction within last month alone. We want right. to know your exit strategy. Mm. Uh, we were targeting around 18 months uh, to be acquired. That, that far I know. There's one option. Yes. 18 okay. months. Do, do, you, have, do 18 you have an acquirer months? company in mind already? Uh, and which I'm part of the world is it from? It. Sorry. No, okay. You're not aware, you just want, do not want to reveal. No, I'm, I really do not know. Sorry. Okay. Right. Are your customers mostly uh, business or are they students? Um, we have a huge amount of uh, business customers. A uh, large proportion is business. Yes, yes. But verbally tell us what ah. exactly. I mean, just um, uh, at least an indication. Yes, um, the first year would be around 300,000 ringgit and the second year would be 1 million and the third year would be 2 million. So the growth rate is around 2 times for the first year and 1 time for the 
So for 500k, uh, what does the investor get uh, uh, stake in your company? Equity. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that would be 20 percent. 20 percent. Yes. So you are you are saying that is uh, what uh, two and a half million. Yes. So thank you very thank much. You. Thank, thank you very you. much. Good luck to you. Thank you very much. So I'm sure Andrea and I Ching sat down and really briefed you thoroughly on the presentation and what to say and things like that. Pretty much, yeah. They did it online because they were still at Silicon Valley when they told me about this. Okay. Now, um, how I'd like to know, are, are you confident that enough that you can possibly make it through to the next level? I'm, I won't say I'm confident, but I do hope that we do, we'll get through. Okay, all the best to, to you, Leon. Thank you very much.